Have you ever heard of Indigo Children? No, I probably heard of it, and it's probably like How are you I'd, I'd relate it to some hippie thing. Um, a hippie thing. Indigo Children. Yes. Oh, it sounds hippie. Well, Ruby, have you ever heard of Indigo Children? I've heard of Indigo Girls. Indigo Girls, yes. Pretty good pair. What's an in, Indigo? We have Indigo. Indigo Child? Yeah. I have no idea. You? I've never heard of it. <laughs> No idea what an indigo child is. I see kind of like a more of an awareness among younger people, depending on where they're from, where they come from, their backgrounds mainly. My daughter, who's eight, told me she waited a long time to come to Earth to have me as a parent, like she had a mission. What's her mission? Did she say? She hasn't said yet, but she seems to be really wise and really all knowing, and old soul. Maybe you know she's that? an indigo child. The blessed gift a child brings, the veils will open when the angel sings. The blessed gift a child brings, the veils will open when the angel sings. And the arms of the earth are open wide, receiving the blessing from inside. The womb of the earth, miracle of birth. Womb of the earth, miracle of earth Brought here from the earth and sky An angel of light come here to try To remind us of the simple bliss That lies within our mother's kiss And the arms of the earth are open wide Receiving the blessing from inside The womb of the earth, miracle of birth Womb of the earth, miracle of birth The womb of the earth, miracle of birth The womb of the earth, miracle of birth To me, the definition of an indigo is someone who's highly sensitive with a warrior personality. A warrior personality means that someone who's here to lead and to take charge. For a long time now, since the 70s, 80s, clairvoyants and psychics have been able to see the color indigo in the biofields, the auric fields of mainly children. Why children? Because it's the vitality of children. It's their life force that renders these colors more visible. I've always seen those souls who are identified as indigos as having this indigo color in their beingness. As I see the soul, they look like a bright, a brilliant star in a midnight sky. And around the clarity of that white light that they are uh, is this circle of indigo light. Well, it's a beautiful mythology. Mm -hmm. It's a way to put in words something that is happening. Mm -hmm. And uh, indigo is a beautiful color, but it's just a color. Mm -hmm. What really means is that human start shifting. Mm -hmm. These are children with an extraordinarily different sense of things, a larger sense of things. Indigo children to me are children who have an expanded awareness, dramatically expanded awareness of everything around them, things seen and unseen. They have a very deep spiritual base, not religious base, spiritual if you talk to them i don't care how they have been raised they have a sense of knowing that there is a greater power there is more than what we see they are also um great healers you know it's they have the the purest heart that you could find I've dealt with a lot of them, and that's what I found them to be. Well, 
忘れないで、えー、いるうあるいは生まれてきたあ子どもたち。
started having this feeling of writing something down about the painting that I was sketching. So I was thinking of something, but I didn't need to think. It was, I, I was just writing effortlessly. And it was, it was I, when I started um, writing and I showed it to my mom, she's just, what, who is, what is these words coming from? And I said, it's from, it's from God. Then I just showed, I used to go 